Hi everybody, it's 78 degrees out here. Today is Sunday, this will probably come out on a different day. But I decided to walk some. So, I'm going to take me a walk, but I'm going to show you my plants first. I've had them out here for a while. Look at these pepper plants. Aren't they crazy? They're doing so good. And these are yellow and red peppers, Big Bertha red peppers and yellow peppers. I'm not sure what these are. I just, I planted them and I didn't think they would do anything. I had them in the arrow garden and look at them. There's some type of pepper, either banana pepper or some type of bell pepper. They're doing great. It's a beautiful day. Gotta get out here and walk. Kitty's asleep. She's taking her nappy right now. So. There's a squirrel. Hey, Mr. Squirrel. He's eating something, I say. Hi there. Finding something to eat? Huh? See, you barely move this one. It's zoomed in and it won't. It moves fast. Okay, I'm gonna put that back down. When it's in full zoom, well, you barely move the cam, the you know phone, and it it's like it jerks it. It's like it's you know doesn't do right for some reason. Somebody said it's supposed to get colder again though. Uh, but one of the cashiers that, or either one that works in the office at Kroger said 19 degrees, I guess, in the next few days. So that'll be crazy. Earlier it was 80 degrees, according to our car. I'm going to have to do something about this. Bush is trying to grow back. That's where I usually have flowers, too. Some of these in here are still flowers, but there's some little blue ones right down there. Blooming. The blue flower, look at that. Ouch. Looks like a morning glory or something. I'm gonna have to chop this back or something. Either that or just let it grow as a bush again, I don't know. I need to figure out what I wanna do with it. I like having flowers there though. That bush, I've been fighting it for years, trying to keep it cut back. It got so big, it was out in the in, in the driveway. It got so wide. I'm gonna have to get out here with my hoe and dig up all that stuff soon. I got time for that though. It's nice to hear the birds. When the mornings in the summer and spring, you, you can hardly hear yourself think sometimes for all the birds singing.
see any hawks around here today. Saw one earlier when we were out. Did that drive with us. You never know where you're gonna see them. They get around. to plant plant some seeds sometime for flowers I don't think I think it's too early though for them to probably in May just to make sure they survive I got tons of seeds from that I harvested from the flowers last year I got a few packets of seeds I think it'll probably be enough. I maybe should have bought some when we were at Dollar Tree the other day. They were still four for a dollar is what it said. I've already done quite a bit of walking today because we walked around Kroger and we did that. Uh, bought a few things there and then I couldn't believe that Kroger didn't have any kind of onion rings. None. And like I said, I used to buy Kroger brand onion rings there so I know they make them, but they don't carry them. And Food City had four different kinds. They had two of the of their brand or whatever brand, Food Club or whatever. I don't know if that's, I don't think Food Club is actually their brand, but it's either Food Club or Food City brand. They had two kinds. One was original or something like that. And one was panko breaded, which I thought would have been good. They also had like um, Red Robin or something like that, onion rings. One of those, like, I forget the name, if that's what it was. And then we saw the Nathan's ones, and that's what we ended up getting. They were a little more, but I know they're going to be better. Everything Nathan's is good. Just got done uh, giving the birds some more suet and a little bit of sunflower seeds and some bread. They ain't eating all that suet. This this one I put in here today I've had for a while and it's kind of hard. I imagine they can still peck on it and get it. It felt pretty. Most of them feel kind of soft, you know. I've had them for a long time, so probably why. It takes them a while to eat the suet, all of it. Good dove. It's nice today, I love this. that dove at? Usually they're on the power lines here. I keep hearing that one over that way. I don't see it. Hear it over that way? My neighbor's dog. Smart dog, too.
Well, I believe I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna take my plants back in here in a little bit. I've been out here for several hours. They're still not used to direct sunlight. They they want to droop, but I get them used to this out here, you know. And then I'll keep keep putting them a little bit more. I got plenty of time until they'll be ready. Um, I can't believe how big those ones are. And those and these that are big. I started them at the same time I did these. I started these at the same time I did these, but they were in the arrow garden, hydroponic. And look at look at them. Isn't that crazy? The difference. All right, everybody. I'm gonna go. I hope you enjoyed this walk with me and little garden progress update. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please press that like button. Also subscribe if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so that you get all my videos as soon as they come out and share this out, please. All right, everybody. Have a great day and I'll see you later on. God bless.